Well, here we are in the little town of Olian Tambo. This is the start of day one of our Inca Trail. There's some pretty cool uh, old Inca ruins up here in the uh, in the hills. But uh, so far it's just been driving. So uh, this is the stop off on the way. Heading down the valley somewhere here and uh, start the big walk. Here we are at the start of the Inca Trail with our intrepid fellow travellers. <laughs> <laughs> You're all on video now. <laughs> Bad place to start, these mountains, but uh, just waiting around. Well, we made it through the checkpoint down here and now we're officially on the trail. So, you know, just looking pleased about that fact. Quite a beautiful valley to walk down. A couple of hours of walk today, four, four or five hours worth today. Well, there's been a fair degree of bucketing down with rain this morning but um, fortunately uh, most of it fell while we're in this little tent that our porters put up while we're having lunch and there is some blue sky up there so hopefully we get lots of that this afternoon well we've barely begun and it's already pretty damn spectacular first little bit of a hill up nothing to worry all good fun the uh, scenery is already just getting so spectacular. This is like two hours walk into it. <laughs> and we've already got our little ruin down here, Inca ruins. Well, here's the view from our campsite from last night. So this is the day one campsite. Quite uh, civilised, really. Served us some pretty awesome food and, uh, yep, all around uh, been good. Well, bit of a new part of the trail here. We're going up and up, but uh, we've come into the jungle-looking area. Definitely uh, quite a difference to the scenery down below. Quite what I imagined. Uh, the Machu Picchu jungle trail to be like. A little bit of rain, but nothing to dampen the spirits yet. All right, well, that's the top up there. Apparently it's about two hours hiking up the way. We've come from somewhere down the other way. Probably been walking for three hours. Oh, with breaks. Pretty cool snowy mountains all around. And this is the two thirds or something of the way up. It's been pretty easy so far really. Slow procession, slow procession coming up the mountain. A few clouds coming over but <laughs> pretty close to the snow and the top. heading to the Seems top. To near butt. <laughs> Teasing us. <laughs> Alright, well we have reached the highest point, I think it's something like 4,000 meters up here. Uh, pretty windy and cold, uh, the breath out of you coming up here. But, uh, pretty stunning uh, views, I think the clouds are covering a little bit of it, but it's still really, really beautiful up here. So, uh, definitely got a sense of satisfaction. It wasn't massively hard, but uh, yeah, geez, the altitude takes it out of you. A lot of fun though, Just really enjoying it. Yeah, that's not bad for a hike really. Oh, by far. Most we've ever been uh, hiking in our lives, I think. So. How you feel, Stefano? Hey, how are you? Good. Nice to meet you. So our trusty handy dandy guide tells us that this is the uh, official beginning of the Inca Trail here where the stones are the original ones. Uh, hola, hola. Here's the, the, por the, the porters doing some serious uh, making us feel uh, lazy by getting them to carry our gear. But uh, Well, we're almost at the bottom now for our rest stop. It's, really taken us pretty much the whole morning but uh, geez it's stunning up here there's really beautiful uh, the valleys that we're going through here is very picturesque and uh, 
Very inspiring stuff, really. Decent little path, makes it pretty easy walking. Well, day three and the path continues. We've got some pretty decent uh, mountains out there in that background. We got a really good view of them before, but it's starting to get some cloud coming through. Not rainy cloud though. So these are the final ruins. And that mountain down there is the Machu Picchu mountain. Which we will be seeing very early tomorrow morning. So pretty beautiful spot to be in really. Surrounded by the mountains, a little bit of cloud, but no rain at all. Fantastic. Well, our Inca trails come right through the middle of the uh, pretty good uh, rainforest here, and we've got uh, a few snowy mountains up there in the background, just covered with a bit of uh, bit of fog. But um, yep, we're just coming down the last stair of the day. It's been a heck of a long uh, walk down, but uh, yep. I'm about ready to finish I reckon, my legs are getting pretty sore, but uh, it's been very, very beautiful. So, we come from way up there and we're heading to our little campsite down there, but uh, pretty awesome the valley here. Our intrepid group and Machu Picchu Mountain just behind them there, so that will be tomorrow's adventure and uh, yeah. Geez, it's been a fair bit of effort hiking up here, but man, it's worth it. It's like 4.30 in the morning, we're at the checkpoint. It's really, really early and it's raining. Great video material. It's uh, quarter past six in the morning. It's uh, stopped raining and pretty beautiful here in the jungle it definitely does feel like uh, this perfect setting for uh, the Machu Picchu uh, Inca Trail walk so misty cloudy foggy not too cold at all well this is the Sun Gate where you see Machu Picchu from On a good day. <laughs> we'll just wait here until hopefully that cloud might lift a bit, but uh, it's apparently just down there. Oh, look at just how spectacular this is. Just awesome. Yeah. That's pretty cool to have walked all this way several days and to be the clouds and mist just really adds to it. Spectacular. There's Team Guinea Pig here on the path. Trusty guides. Ah, yes, the guinea pigs are lucky. That's right. <laughs> the guinea pigs. <laughs> Woo! Well, it took uh, four days of pretty solid walking, but uh, geez, it's worth it when you get here. That's a pretty spectacular view there. So here we have this fantastic temple stone work. You just get these amazing cut to fit blocks. Perfect fits, you know. A few points here where they've made the stones just absolutely fit in. Pretty fantastic stuff. Yeah, awesome Inca houses. They would have had a pretty good view. There's beautiful mountains out here. They're so jagged. I could handle this for a view. Don't know if I'd like to walk up and down it to get there every day though. Plenty of room for clambering over it still, but I think the views from the top are the best. This will be a nice break spot here. Not the worst. Well, 
from the towering heights of the mountains where we were up Machu Picchu we finally got down here to Aguas Caliente uh, markets and everything here and uh, it's been fantastic to shower have a modern toilet and uh, get the train back from here and this is the end of a fantastic adventure it's been really really great so anyway on to the next one and no true Inca trail would be complete without a sacrifice. So here's our offering to the gods, our guinea pig dinner. Yummo.